Uh, last year was Stokes' first year um, for the inaugural um, Golfing for Miracles tournament. Mm -hmm. Tell us a little bit about that and what a huge success it was. It was an amazing event. Uh, it was, as you said, the, the first time that we've done the tournament. Uh, what amazed me was really just the quality of the event from top to bottom. You had the golf tournament on Friday, you had the, uh, the dinner and silent auction and live auction on Saturday night. Uh, having done golf tournaments for charitable organizations before, I was impressed that we had a full field uh, and it filled up very early so there was a lot of competition for the slots were available. Uh, what, the, what the tournament allowed us to do from a standpoint of the money that was made off of it was continue the operation of the league. We, we try to run very lean and very effectively. We don't have paid staff. We do all of the work ourselves as volunteer board members. So the funding from the tournament allows us to make sure that we keep our league equipped. We've got jerseys to buy. We've got bats and balls to make sure we have available uh, you know, things for our concession stand as well. So uh, the funding from the tournament is a critically important part of our budget on an annual basis now and uh, we're grateful for the opportunity to come out and be the beneficiary of uh, the proceeds from the tournament. It was a remarkable night uh, on Saturday night when we had the dinner and the live and silent auction. Matter of fact, uh, a bit of a funny story to, to relate, one of our board members ended up purchasing, uh, I'm not sure if it was completely on purpose or not, but ended up purchasing uh, a round trip uh, ticket to Hawaii. Uh, and found out later on that the dates were on days he couldn't go. <laughs> so, so he ended up, you know, it was, it was a blessing in disguise for someone else who got the opportunity to take that trip. But it was uh, just a great event, a lot, a lot of fun. And again, uh, a full field, which was amazing. Many first year tournaments don't achieve that. Well, thank you for talking with us today, Michael. Um, and folks, remember, there's still time, August 4th and the 5th. Please save the date and let us know. You can reach out to tpadron at stokesauto.com for more information and let us know. There's also um, sponsorship opportunities available. So if you're a local business owner and would like to support our Miracle League, please reach out to tpadron at stokesauto.com and let us know.